Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to The Breakdown. In this episode, we have Rustam Babayev against Evgeny Prudnik in the 2013 Euro Arm. Let's see it in action. Into the hook they go, deep, deep hook. Rustam Babayev with the more compact arm, more power, and looking for a finish. But Evgeny Prudnik very much looking for hand control. Evgeny Prudnik trying to squeeze his cup deeper and deeper. You can see Rustam Babayev being very cautious about his movements. If he moves too much too soon, he will lose more and more hand control. Evgeny Brudnik sinking, sinking, trying to get a deep, deep cup, waiting for the right time to start to go on an offensive surge. Rustam Babayev, again, being very patient, not trying to lose any position in this moment right here. Evgeny Brudnik testing a little bit there for a press. You can see testing, trying to get the shoulder behind, exposes his hand, and Rustam Babayev feels the weakness in Evgeny Brudnik's hand all of a sudden and seizes control of the hand control, Evgeny Prudnik. Let's have a look at that replay. You'll see as Prudnik exposes the hand because of his press, it opens up the opportunity for Rustam Babayev to take control of the hand and wrist. And, and Prudnik is now forced into a situation where he is wrist back and defending with shoulder and bicep. An unnatural position for Rustam Babayev and an elbow foul is called and the match will restart. Here is the restart. Yevgeny Prudnik goes on a more offensive surge straight away, trying to get the match done. A lot of down pressure, big rotation, and getting that shoulder behind again now. We can see Rustam Babayev survives that initial onslaught, but there is such a tight position on, on Yevgeny Prudnik. The down pressure is repeated, and Rustam Babayev trying to get more shoulder angle in, but can't quite get the shoulder as deep as he would like it. Yevgeny Prudnik now getting into a press position, shoulder behind back to the hook again repeated surges oh and we've got a pin there was an error there from Rustin Babayev let's have a look in slow motion Rustin Babayev tries to commit to a top roll and because of that he loses connection to the power and Evgeny Prudnik able to get the finish there we go 1-0 with Evgeny Prudnik coming back to the next round of the match in the final uh, Babayev going on a much more offensive drive right from the get-go. Opens himself up. Let's look at the replay. He overcommits, and that allows Brudnik to get control. You can see these initial surges. He stays quite tight. But Rustin Babayev, you'll see him in a moment. He will drop low below the table, exposing almost a pin there, but exposing his arm allows Evgeny Brudnik to get more hand control, get into a tighter position. From here, Evgeny Brudnik is in control. He starts to take the hand and wrist. And we've got a slip. What will it be called? It is called a foul on Rustin Babayev for letting go. Have a look at the replay. Getty Prudnik drops onto the tricep, rolls through the hand, and the slip there with Babayev not holding on. It is called a foul. The restart will happen now. And they're deep into a hook again. Rustin Babayev trying to get offensive early, but... It, the, the, the gassing out factor is coming into play now. Evgeny Prudnik super tight. You can see him starting to get right over the rotation of Babayev. Super tight. Starts to peel the hand again. Lays under the tricep. Can't quite get it on the first attempt. Second attempt comes back and feel the weakness in Babayev's hand going. And there we have it. Another elbow foul, but it was didn't matter much anyway. The win to Evgeny Prudnik. The replay here. You can see how tight Evgeny Prudnik is. He levers off the tricep. Rolls into the fingers. Babayev absolute maximum effort to contain that one he returns in again goes in to go out again and you can see the hand is about to go on Babayev there it goes and the win is inevitable awesome match there at the 2013 Euro Arm ladies and gentlemen that was the breakdown